Hi Cancers, welcome back to my channel. This is Rogue Tarot. We're getting right into messages to you. See what does your person have to say to you without any ego pride or fear. All right, so we have, wow, that one oh, wanted to come out fast. We have the Palace of Coins, Three of Cups in Reverse, the King of Wands, and the Tower. So this could potentially uh, be this fire sign if you're dealing with one, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, having a tire moment in regards to you. You could be dealing with a Virgo here as well. The Hermit energy is in reverse. They're no longer remaining isolated. They want to take action. Why? Because they have gotten out of a third party situation for some of them. They were living with this person. This tower has completely crumbled. For those of you whose person is not dealing with anybody, um, they miss you. They miss the fun times. Um, they miss going out with you. And they're kind of getting an epiphany, and aha moment where they're no longer wanting to be in isolation. But there is a lot of sadness and regret in regards to your connection. And there is that three of swords. So second, third party confirmation. Um, someone that could have kids with this person that they're that's that nah, could have kids with this other person person that they're dealing with it doesn't have to be um they want to talk to you uh, you guys definitely aren't communicating with the ace of swords or in reverse or, or you're just not communicating well in regards to what this third party issue is it's supposed to be you guys living together um wanting to split the bills and handle things on that end but you guys just can't see eye to eye you know they, they want to come in and um, rely a message to you with this Knight of Swords energy. They're definitely getting out of a rough cycle in regards to finances for some of them. Why is the Tower here? Six of Cups in reverse. Overall energy is a tree of life, so the world in reverse. It's like they can't start a new cycle, a new journey without you. Now that this third party interference is gone, they want to come in. Um, I'm just going to see what this King of Swords has to say to you. This kind of wanted to jump out. I know I messed up everything. Exactly. What is this tire moment about? I feel you even though we're apart. So this could be them also realizing with the six of cups that you that you have a soul connection here, that they feel you even though we're apart. Like it's something deeper there. Like this is connection that they might have not felt once before. Well they feel it now. And then we have I will wait for a sign from you. I wish I could share my good news with you. So this could also be them getting a new house or signing a new house, moving into a new lease. And they want to tell you this. They, the third party could also be um, a family situation, you know, dealing with the mother or father, just trying to get out of that family household. They definitely have gotten out of that. And now they're coming forward wanting to take action. So as the palace of coins showing up, the four of cups in reverse, no longer in frustration, but feeling overwhelmed really in their head on kind of what to do next because of their past actions. So it's like now they're I'm settled. They're telling you like, I don't, every time I think about things and wanting to rush forward, I get so overwhelmed, but I know this is what I have to do. So what are you conflicted and overwhelmed about with the seven of cups? About them lying, being sneaky, trying to cover things up, and now they're trying to heal it. So this is what they're overwhelmed about and conflicted. On one end, they want to apologize, heal things, and try to start anew. But on the other hand, they know that, you know, they were potentially lying and not being upfront about things that you asked them. Because I feel like you asked them about the situation so many times and they just kept saying, oh, it's nothing. It's nothing you have to worry about. Um, I got the situation under control. There's nothing going on between me and this person. And now they want to come back and heal things. You're like, oh, no, I'm going to keep it where it's at. For some of you here, clarify the Ace of Swords in reverse. What did they not see before? So we're going to say that I, I I didn't, at the time, I took advantage of your emotions with this King of Cups in reverse energy. Here's your energy, Cancers. Come in dealing with another water sign, uh, another Cancer, Scorpio or Pisces. They didn't follow their true emotions when it came to you, right? They didn't follow their intuition. They're going to tell you that. The feelings I have for you are always there. I just never took it seriously. And this is what they regret. Clarify the Ace of Swords in reverse. Yeah, they want to come in very passionately, but they know they can't because it's, it's going to create a huge unbalance between you two. The Sagittarius is trying to come forward. Could have been lying about how much money they made or had gambling issues. Yeah, they want to come in, take a leap forward, but they know um, right now 
they know that it's not the right thing to do. They have to um, plan some more. And this is why it's giving them anxiety because the time is in reverse now where they have to make the step. They have to take the leap of faith if they want to make it right for you. Um, Cancers, I feel like you are completely done with this person. You're like, you got to leap first before I even take a chance, right? I'm not doing putting in any work in this relationship anymore because you hurt me. You broke my heart. You put me through all this pain, all this sorrow with the Three of Swords showing up twice now. And the Three of Cups energy. They're talking to other people about um, trying to work this out with you. And other people are like, no, nah, you don't have a chance with cancer. It's done. Just move on. And they're like, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not paying attention to them. Now that I'm free, Nine of Pentacles here with the Eight of Pentacles and Page of Pentacles. I want to risk it. I want to come forward. Some of you are not going to see this coming with the Nine of Swords energy, this air sign. Yeah. But they know that they have to make this decision. Eight of Cups and Judgment. They know. They regret walking, letting you walk away or them walking away without trying to work on things. They're getting their karma because, like I said, what they're overwhelmed about is apologizing to you, healing this when they know that they were dead as wrong. Their pride and ego got in the way. You see this Seven of Swords imagery. They're carrying the Five of Swords, right? So their pride and ego got in the way of this, of their heart, Two of Swords. So, <laughs> karma, they're really reaping what, they, what they're sowing right now, Cancers, um, on things not working out. And now it's like they don't want to let you go. This King of Wands energy, they are so, um, feel very much attracted to you. They feel unstable without you. It's like now that they have this palace of wands, or points, I'm sorry, um, this household here, they feel empty. They feel empty in it without you if they move into a new house or lease. You guys know if you did. I feel like <laughs> someone... Uh, close friend or you knew that this person was moving before you guys ended yeah they feel is <laughs> look at this judgment showing up the nine of cups is in reverse they're completely drained without you emotionally because you were their queen of cups right like you were the comfort the caring the nurturing always making sure they were okay and it was always one-sided yeah the passion was there but you always wanted something more and now that their feelings are growing, their two of pentacles are juggling here on wanting to come forward. They want to ask you out, but they're not going to risk it. Again, for some of them, they know that they were juggling this third party here. So a lot of harsh words were said, which is why they're struggling to come forward to you. Um, some of you, they could have said, like, I don't never have feelings for you. Something harsh, something weird like that when they were lying about it. Some of you, this was friends. You guys were friends first. You started hooking up. Things got too much involved. This person was ready to settle down. And now this is where you're at. Um, you feel completely taken advantage of. They know that. This is why you guys aren't communicating. This is why they want to come in and say sorry. They see a victory on a little glimmer of hope on things working out, but they have anxiety on doing this. I don't know how to talk to you. I don't know how you're going to react, which is why I'm hesitating right now because we have the six of coins in reverse here. So we have the nine of swords and the eight of swords. This is them kind of clearing their path, right? Choosing the two of wands energy to where they're no longer trying to feel frustrated and anxiety, but every time they try to get out their head, they get pushed back, right? But there's clearing here. Clarity is trying to come. I'm surprised the ace of swords hasn't came out yet. Why are these swords here? Yeah. It's also be them holding back because of a child. If you're dealing with someone who had a child with another person, they went back to them or things just didn't work out, they they don't want to come forward because of that. You, they know and you know the child will always be there. So how can you um, put love and attention towards me? This Capricorn Earth sign energy that Virgo we saw at the beginning of the reading, Taurus energy, they're being really much in their heads and very logical right now about this. As you can see how I'm kind of rambling there. Um... <sighs> It's that how could you love me when you have to take care of another child and still pay attention to that person because you share a child for some of you. Yep. Why didn't they end this burden and to just come and talk to you? Libra energy. All right. Why is the six of coins showing up in reverse? This could be twin flame energy. They could have been dealing with the karmic again. They completely walked away. This happened very fast. I feel like some of them, the karmic, did not see it. Um, but this twin flame energy could be dealing with the Aries. They are stepping up to the plate. 
they're very much into their masculine energy as you can see with the king of wands king of pentacles and the emperor in reverse the devil in reverse they're trying to get out their head they're making a decision right now on doing that right like tired of feeling sorry for themselves something has got to give i need to get my cancer back and try to figure out things we have the moon card here pisces so the emperor always conquers all that's what they do they're going to get over this hump uh with the hangman just went through a full moon in Aquarius last weekend so um we were in that period of rebirth starting a new chapter with our for ourselves no longer dealing with um necessary burdens and now this energy this person is shifting to where things have came to light and they're actually making moves towards it right which is why this tire moment is here because now they're trying to make it work they can't stuck like, again same how the tree of life is in reverse they cannot have this new start without you they cannot think think they cannot think about long term without you and if you turn it down it's like all right so be it at least i told cancer how i felt right i'm gonna see what this emperor how is this emperor feeling right now all right we have keys on the ring many options decision i'll convince you string along one night stand we have coffin endings brings new beginnings growth change liberation transition yeah i feel like it's that friendship relationship that i was um picking up picking up on earlier to where you guys were friends for there was attraction there you started hooking up this person wasn't ready to settle down they were stringing you along though saying that when they get their own place you're going to move in i'll be committed blah 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 but you caught them in a the third party and now it's like i'm done right we have coffin and these brings new beginnings so um, there is a chance for some of you if you want this to work there's closure issues that i feel like you will um uh, at least listen to this person about you're gonna receive what you need no matter what cancers we have to set this person again outdated thinking conditioning replaying events over and over in your head they cannot get you out of their minds here this virgo energy is hesitating but this tire moment is pushing them through because for some of you like i said six of cups and reverse twice you guys have a lot of past energy with each other. There's the Queen of Cups. I knew she was going to come out. They miss you a lot. They're suffering. Ooh. <laughs> Soon as I said they miss you a lot, guys. Scorpio energy. This person hurts. My heart chakra is hurting. This death card and Ten of Cups in reverse is tense. This will also be, again, confirmation that they're ending a family situation. They're disappointed. And now that they have to come forward and explain explain themselves like okay i love a fan situation and cancers you're like okay and like you think i'm gonna come back to you after leaving all this so this is why all these cups are in reverse because if if you see up right if all they did was heal this thing with you treated you better this would be a great transformation some of you guys would be married engaged and committed relationships right now right if they acknowledge you for who you were or who you were to them, how they treated, how you treated them. If they acknowledge that, that you were helping them heal, helping them get through all, all these obstacles they were going through, then this would have worked out. But instead, they made their own choices. So it's really eating them up inside. You know, this is why all these cards are in reverse. That they're, they're kind of going through a dark night of the soul over you. So there's your energy. They're coming towards you. They're tired of things not manifesting. Yeah, you're angry. You're in pain. You know, they're going to try to come forward and try to, um, make things right they really are upset that they hurt you and if you see this guy is kind of covering this heart shrug right here they're in a lot of pain as you are they hate that they hurt you a lot but like i said for some of you cancers you're going to decide to let this person in because there's love there gemini energy this person definitely feels the loss of you but there's that soulmate connection <laughs> there's that soulmate connection coming out there's that passion. You guys communicate well. You love um, hanging out, laughing, talking. Just you can be. You could be with each other for hours, and you know, it's and that's all right. But this has a chance to turn back around if only you you know want to deal with this. If you can forgive this person, I feel like this person really messed up. If they really want to make it work, they're really genuine. They really hate that they hurt you. So, cancers, let me know if this resonated. I mean, this is some intense as energy here, all right? Just gonna get some action steps because um any action steps any movement soon ten of pentacles yeah queen of cups action steps page of cups yeah they're coming in <laughs> moon is in reverse i'm no longer hiding i'm coming in i'm no longer hiding i'm coming in is what they literally just said to me i'm coming in hot <laughs> some of them have a really upbeat personality all right cancers i'm gonna leave it there and have a wonderful week